Hello, my pretties. How are you guys? The prettyoracle.com spelled just like that right there is um my website is where you're gonna be able to find the my products and services. And then also if you guys are looking to tip me after the read or um exchange energy with me in any way, number one, you can like the video that is free and I thank you in advance, and then also my Cash App and my PayPal donation link, as well as my Amazon wish list, is in the description box below. Um, let me read you guys a testimony. Okay, so we have, yes, thanks Pretty Oracle for the products I purchased from your website. The spray helped me so much for protection and a dismantled candle worked a miracle in clearing up the voodoo doll problem, which was plaguing me. I couldn't have done it without you. Um, and then also, I will read you one that I got today. So sis, why your cord cutting bundle gave me karmic justice? God is so good. He put you right in my energy field when I first started my journey till now. You're so wonderful. Keep going. Oh yeah, I finished the bundle two Sundays ago. And I cord cut from marijuana. Thank you from one sister to another. I appreciate you guys. Okay, so those were two um, testimonies from people who receive my product. Some of you guys, okay, so, 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 okay. I'm gonna talk to you about what's going on with this person, but first, I want to, you know, do a checkup on who this person is for you, okay? So let's do a checkup on who this person is for you. I already have the message, I already know what's up. Um, some of it was mentioned in another video, but um, it's more clarification on it. So let's see, who is this person? So whoever this person is, um, they were doing spells on you. And another thing about them is they may have a B, a B view, whether physically, mentally, definitely spiritually, okay? Because I'm seeing a spiritual attack. Tell me about this person that we're talking about. Who are we speaking about? I just heard it could be multiple people. Is is you know, we have mm, we have I bleep cougars down for money so this is somebody who could sell ass for the devil or make money and then we or make money um or make money from the exchange of y'all know what i'm talking about okay and then we have a woman scorned okay so this could be a a, a woman you know, who's upset with you about something for whatever reason. And then we have manipulated. This could actually be a male and a female is what I'm seeing here. So if it's a male, you know, he may um, sell himself or whatever. You know what I'm saying? And if it's a female, she may sell herself too. Um, I'm also getting if, if this is a man. Look, so we have tag team hate. Friends helping with hate doing black magic and they and using my fuckery. So this this could like I said, you know, this could be happening over social media, but like I said, um this could be several people with that tag team hate energy. But uh, or this could be a person that was a part of a group of several people. Ew. Medications to treat Garnamidia Garna Garnamidia. <laughs> Yo, somebody could have got a two in one. Like, somebody could have got a two-in-one burn. Like, like two diseases in one. You understand what I'm saying? Like, how nasty could you be? Anyway, this person is under judgment. For some of y'all, this person may work in a, in a legal field or something like that or have legal issues. But spiritually, they have a big legal issue here. And that's what we're getting ready to talk about. So we have player. This person is in anxiety, okay? This is a person that tells a lot of half-truths. Whenever I see this card, I always think of, like, them people that be like, oh, good morning, queen, or or, or um, grand rising, whatever. You know what I'm saying? One of those. A lot of good morning queens, but you'll find out that that type of person is like misogynistic or, you know, whatever. 
something about being chased. So you could have not wanted to be with this person. I'm hearing this person worship money or they down with the money worshiping people. Okay. Okay. All right. Now let's talk about what's going on with this person. So basically... Then you have an, this individual over here doing spells. Now, whatever spell they did, it has backfired. The spell backfired. And it's causing for them to hear things, see things, and some more shit. But then also, I'm getting that whoever this is attached something to them, right? They... Could have traveled somewhere because that's what we picked up in the other read. They traveled somewhere to attach something to them. And I tell y'all, you know, these karmics, they be going on vacation and, you know, you'll see them and take a picture near some sort of landmark, you know, and um, welcome to Miami or some shit like that. And it's like they really going to see the witch doctor or whatever. OK, um, somebody did something ritualistically, attached something to themselves. And whatever, what, what the mix didn't go right or the shit backfired, there's some sort of negativity that they're receiving as a result of attaching something to them that was supposed to give them knowledge and, 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 and power, okay? This is something that has to do with, you know, this Ten of Cups energy here is making me feel like, you know, um, it, it's a group of them. It was a community of them. Okay, like it, it, it's several of them that went through this. Um, ritual or whatever this is. Okay, there it's like a coven. Okay, with this energy of awakening, I'm going to tell you like there's something here with this person. And we picked this up um, in uh, another read like they're experiencing like sexual urges and stuff like that that are number one illegal and number two um is not like them but it's a result of the manifestation of whatever negative entity they attach to them now this person may have used this entity that is attached to them to curse you or something like that or sent it at you sent it your way and i feel like you know a lot of times when you have these vampires, right, they will use whatever negative entity that's attached to them and send it to you so that it could suck on you, okay? On your energy. Now, something was done here with this energy of banishment or 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 hex and it's like it, it's it, this could even be a return to sender whatever this is with the tower here it backfires so now what this person is doing is they're either going back to the to the person or uh, that that attached this to them or they're going to someone else to try to take this shit off of them like they're literally going for with the energy of protection and containment, they're literally going uh, to either the same person or an, or another person. For some of you guys, this person is from that person's homeland, okay? Like wherever they from. And another way that I was seeing this, right? Because you see the energy of containment, they trying to put like like uh, get whatever this is under control because the uh, the awakening energy, okay, is is, is being is being um. You know, referenced here as awakening. It's like, nah, that ain't not something about Africa too. Okay, somebody could be going to Africa or um, looking for reaching out to Africa. Okay, could be on WhatsApp or any sort of social media. Um, and 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 they and they looking for help. Okay, with this because it went wrong. Now, um, they feel bogged down and pinned down, literally, like so, like they feel like they ah. Okay, I heard lonely once the drugs are done. I feel like dying. I feel like dying. Lonely. That's little Wayne. Somebody could be here from Louisiana, okay, or seeking out the help of someone from Louisiana. Because what I'm getting from this is like it's a place where like. 
all the witch doctors be. You know what I'm saying? One of the places where, like, you know, this type of shit is, like, where I'm hearing this type of shit happens every day. Now, smoke more than a little bit. What are you, an idiot? Somebody, somebody, somebody short here. Because we got little C's and little wings. Somebody here may be short. Or... What I was getting in the other read that was referencing this was like, somebody is too big for their britches. Like, this could be a young person. Like, this could be a younger person. It's just like, you don't know what you're doing. And that's the problem. The mix didn't go right. And then another thing that I wanted to tell y'all, because this could go several ways. You have to get in where you fit in. You know what I'm saying? But, like, somebody went to attach some sort of entity to them. And in the contractual agreement, it was like, you are to do this uh, malicious thing to a specific person. The shit that they, in, in, a, in a certain amount of time, time ran out, time ran out. And it was in the contractual agreement that this specific entity would literally take them over, okay? They would lose rights to the control over themselves or whatever, okay? Um, and what this person did is went behind the, the you know, um, and did a double deal. Like, kind of like went behind the person who they made this deal with or the group that they made this deal with and went to a different spiritualist to try to... Um, get protection from the very same entity that they've been allowing to use their their vessel okay it's like okay you have a specific contract over here with a specific entity you didn't fulfill the contract so now said entity is going to um things are going to happen between you and that said entity bad things whatever was in that contract i don't know you know what i'm saying and then they go to another spiritualist to try to banish whatever this entity is that they gave rights to themselves because they don't want it on them no more um first of all some of the things one of the things that i'm seeing that they did with this mad with this spell or something like that that they did on 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 you or whoever they did it on or several people whoever the fuck um it has to do with like brain, kidneys, and da, da 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 something about organs here, okay? Somebody don't feel right if they not um on the drogas is is what I'm getting. They don't feel right if they not on the drogas. I don't like it, y'all. This came out last time, and I keep trying to avoid what this is. But somebody is attracted sexually to something that's going to land them in jail. Put it like that. It's illegal what they're attracted to. It's illegal. Somebody attached something to them that will help them to deceive an empress energy from their past or something like that. Um, show me the six of cups. Yeah, I feel like um, they keep thinking about this person. That's another thing too that came up. This, I can't get you off my mind. I can't get you off my mind. Somebody is living, uh, and it feels like an empress, okay? So it could be you. You know what I'm saying? That, I, that I'm reading for, but like, um, they cannot get this particular empress off their mind. Like, your feet is, is, is planted deeply in this person's head. And it's like, that's not what, that's not what they wanted, okay? They, it, it was supposed to be vice versa. Like, especially, like, when they go going to sleep, especially when they go going to sleep, they're not able to control themselves is what it feel like. For somebody, the person that they going to see about this lives in, like, like, um, 
in the woods, like a wooded area or the country of, like deep in the country or deep in the country of whatever, like, 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 um, Like, places in the Caribbean have countrysides. You know what I'm saying? Countries. Uh, in the country is what it would be, is what it would be called. Like, in the sticks or, like, uh, in West Bubble. You know? Like that. Like, deep, deep down. Way down in the valley deep. Who? Some. Uh, is it Dolomite? Child, I don't know where I got that from. But that's what I'm hearing. Way down in the jungle deep, he says. The four of wands is out here twice. Give me a second. Mm. So see, and that's they trying not to they trying look the ten of swords like they trying not to think about you. They can't stop thinking about you. And you know what this could possibly be? Remember when I said, like, uh, you know, they were, they attached this to them to get money or uh, goals or accolades off the backs of an empress from their past? Okay. This could be a person from your past who sent something out at you so you can constantly be thinking about them or something like that in order for you to uh you know come back to them or whatever and 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 they have your mind all fucked up because this, this person wants to dominate you and suck you dry of whatever prosperous energy you do have or do you something for um a reward of some sort of prosperous energy you understand what i'm saying okay now it seems like this shit backfired and they're obsessed with you they don't like it. This seven of wands being here. I don't, y'all, I don't like this. Because this could even be, with the page of cups, this could even be your, your offspring, okay? But the, the energy of children is all up and through this reading and it was up and through that other one. And I don't like it. But for some of y'all, this could be your kid. You know what I'm saying? Not kid, but you know what I mean. Your offspring. Somebody was paid to possibly do something in your home. Or to, to this person could have got like paid or was sent on a mission to do something to you at your house or some shit like that. You know what I mean? They couldn't get in your home with the seven of wands. It's like you refuse to let them in your home or some shit. This person was not able to reach you. I'm getting like this person work with other people. Somebody out here pop um pill. And we're the pill man now. We need a blue dog. Uh, whatever this is, they were under deep illusions. Like, and the devil and the magician, the devil and the seven of cups. Like, they were told or made to do or do, or they do, like, uh, various things. Evil shit for money. But I feel like whoever this person was, they could not handle, they cannot handle whatever. Like you see this energy of high priestess um, with responsibility. Like this person cannot handle what they was doing. They cannot handle it's, it. Whatever, whatever entity they attach to them or whatever magic they playing in, it is effing them up. Seriously. Or whatever drawbacks they're receiving from not being able to fulfill this contract 
or carry out this dirty deed is they cannot handle it. And that's why I always tell y'all, don't do no shit. I don't do no shit is what I should say. That I can't handle. I don't do nothing that I can't pay consequences for. If I can't afford the consequences, I ain't going to do it. And, and see, that's why a lot of these people get themselves in trouble because they are employed by individuals who are smart enough to know that if they fuck with a, a divine being, that they can't afford the consequences. They got a lot to lose. They got shit to do. And that's why they pay dumbass individuals like this because literally like dumb is, is you know they ignorant they don't know a lot of times they don't know the drawbacks of it the way you the way they get the shit get kicked to them when they sign them contracts is like you'll get money you'll get power just do this it's easy it's a lot of y'all and y'all have a plan and da, 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 da. literally dumb and ignorant to what could really happen or the drawbacks and that's why the people that they employed by don't do it themselves because they don't have it to lose. They don't they don't want to they don't want to sacrifice what it takes to lose if they do this. That's why they have other people do it. And so this is what um being a a flunky gets you. Period. Show me anything else. And then like if they saw if they did some sort of contractual agreement, you know, and they go into somebody else to like override that contractual agreement. Like, oh, now get this thing off of me that, that I agreed and signed a contract that it could be on, on me. Get this shit off of me. And they go into somebody else to do it. They're going to have problems with whoever this is that they, that they signed the first agreement with. Okay, we have ego. The illusion of being trapped, placing too much importance on material items. Getting caught up in fear and worry. Somebody is stressed. This could be a Leo. Somebody is very stressed out because they place too much um, importance on material items. They eyes was bigger than their stomach. And this is the shit that they got themselves into. And then we have the dreamer. Embrace your true purpose. Begin a new adventure. Trust yourself. Yeah. Like, like. My guys is like, you know, putting it to me like, what happened? Yeah, the hermit. You know, find or be a mentor. Take a break from society. This this could be a Virgo, y'all, too. This could be a Virgo or Aries. But, like, they're basically saying. They're basically saying, like, what happened? You took on the, the job to be some sort of hermit and do some, some weird shit in the dark. Embrace your true purpose. This is what you signed up for. So how are you going to like try to like renege and go to a whole other person or, or run back to where you got this done at? You know what I'm saying? To say, help, stop, wait, no, don't. You have contractual obligations to fulfill. They can't handle this shit. But they was willing to do it to you or someone else. But they can't handle that same energy that they sent out for somebody else. It's eating, it's eating them alive. They feel trapped. Show me this energy. Look, fate. This is just this is just how how it was supposed to be. This is just it. And they think they could get out of it. They're not getting out of it. <laughs> Some of you guys, they are, um, separating themselves from everybody because they're having, um, mental issues. They're experiencing mental issues. Yeah. So you see this energy of schedule. I told y'all they didn't do this, whatever this was in a, in a, in a, in a good enough amount of time. But if this is a couple y'all. This couple conspired against you. You were connected to one of them or both of them, but at least one of them sexually. Okay. Yeah, they tried. They they didn't. This schedule 
that they were on, this um, time constraint that they were on to cause some sort of natural disaster in your life to steal your gifts or to receive a gift for causing some sort of natural disaster or some, or some sacrifice type shit, boom, it didn't happen. It didn't happen. So this is why they're going through this. They're supposed to feel trapped. They're supposed to be hearing things. They're supposed to be losing their mind. They're supposed to be attracted to uh, shit that um, that uh, is illegal for them to be attracted to or do or engage in sexual contact with because they connected a, a unclean spirit to them. So what did you think was going to happen? It was cute when it was you that they was doing it to. But it ain't cute no more. They don't like it. They not enjoying themselves no more. Ain't nothing funny no more. If you remember, these is the people that was laughing. I mean, agreement. You see that? Agreement. Somebody's trying to get out of the agreement. Look, stubborn, stubbornness. So they were told. So they can't say, you know, that they didn't know. They can't say they didn't know because there's a warning right here. Something told them not to do it. Their better judgment, maybe. Even though they may not have been fully aware of the consequences. But some people just don't really care when 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 you got when you, you know, offering them some, uh, you know, something that they can't refuse. Maybe money, whatever. Yeah. This, ooh, child, somebody is strange. Like somebody is really strange. They losing it. I heard. Don't provoke me to anger or else you will be in danger. <laughs> Don't provoke me to anger. Somebody better not provoke this person to anger. Because whoever this person is, they bugging out. This is the type of person that could do you something and then like, you know... You know, the people that be looking real strange in they mug shots. And you like, oh, hell no. They was possessed. You know what I'm saying? But then, like, afterwards, they saying, like, oh, I don't know what happened. This is that. This is somebody who could do you something and don't remember it. Because this is, like, schizo. Like, it's like, it, 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 it whatever this thing is, it's like entities jumping in and out. And ain't none of them nice. Ain't none of them nice. This They telling me that. Yo, that's crazy. That sweet dream came up. They telling me that when this person wakes up, like they don't decide who they're going to be. What whichever entity decides to reside in them that day is who they're going to be. They don't get to decide who they're going to be when they wake up in the morning. And you over here with the sweet dream of self-love. It's like y'all lives are two totally are on two totally different opposite ends of the spectrum. This person is stuck in this marriage, so to speak, this um, connection, this partnership, this contract with a negative entity. And it's going to be the very entity that takes them down, the entity that was supposed to take you down or whoever they sent it to or whoever they was going to use it against. OK, or whoever they tried to use it against. So if you did like a return of sender. Whatever you did, you did that shit. It worked. But I ultimately think it was time that ran out. That was the issue. It was time that ran out and then they had to... Because you win some, you lose some. You understand what I'm saying? And this person gambled um, with their life. Um, and they lost this one. But they not they not able to pay what this is that they would have to pay. And they have to pay with their mind. Okay? And they have to pay with their soul. So I hope that helped.